To upload a file to Sonix, you simply click the Upload button. There are three different ways to upload, single track, multi-track, and existing transcript. Starting on the right, you can upload an audio or video file. And if you already have your own transcript, you can upload that and Sonix will automatically match the transcript to the audio and timestamp every word like magic. The next one is multi-track. If you're capturing speakers on separate tracks, you can upload each of those tracks and Sonix will automatically combine them to create a single transcript. This method is great. It tends to be the most accurate and you'll have automatic speaker labeling too. Lastly, the most commonly used upload is single track. This is the one I'm going to use. Just a quick note that Sonix accepts dozens of file formats, including MP3, MP4, and WAV files. You can upload a file from Zoom, Dropbox, Google Drive, or even a YouTube link. Vimeo links also work too. You can drag and drop into the window or select from your computer. I'm gonna move myself over here and select a file from my computer. This status bar shows the upload status. It needs to turn green and be complete before you can click transcribe all the way down here. Moving myself over here so I'm not covering the button. You can upload multiple files to upload at once. You can also rename the files by typing in these boxes. I'm gonna change this to welcome to Sonics by Crystal. And if you decide you don't wanna transcribe the file anymore, you can remove it right here. You can also select a folder destination for your file. I'll put this into new uploads and make sure that the language selection is correct. Once all that's done, click transcribe. Now our advanced artificial intelligence algorithms will start to transcribe your file. It takes about five minutes to transcribe a one hour file. Here you can see the status of the transcription. You will also get an email letting you know that the transcription is finished. And it's done. Once it's done, you just simply click on the file to view your transcript. And that's it, a full transcript in roughly five minutes. Cool, huh?